into town, you can bet it will be the hottest ticket around. Joe knows how to polish off an opponent. Okay, okay. For this one, or as WWE Hall of Famer Gorilla Monsoon might have said, the SRO signs went out early. When this guy's on, look out. Caught him with a big boot. On the mark. Came to Washington, D.C. in 2000, which wasn't all that far from me at the time. You couldn't go anywhere without hearing somebody talking about WWE coming to town. And that Backlash 2000 car that Byron brought up earlier might have been the most chaotic main event we've ever seen between The Rock and Triple H. And in the end, it was The Rock defeating the game for the WWE Championship, despite Mr. McMahon stacking the deck against The Rock in a major way, including naming Shane McMahon as the special guest referee. Kane showing some expert prowess here. 1980s, which were great, don't get me wrong, but now they've really grown into such a major spectacle. Oh boy, he is rolling. Well, a huge opportunity here. Kane gonna go up high. What you were saying before, Byron, was spot on. WWE pay-per-views today really take over the entire city, and people travel from all over the world just to say they were a Kane is looking at this right now. Oh, he turns it around. Come on, baby! Come on. Look out. <laughs> Nobody comes back from this. You gotta think about using the finisher here pretty soon, I would think. Just pick up the win and move on. There's no need to keep this thing going longer than necessary. Will this be enough? And he kicks out. He is not gonna go down without a fight, Michael. Man, Chris Jericho, what offense. And no luck against Kane there. Dodges a bullet there. He's making a statement here with this attack. Across the shoulders. Oh, look at this. Raining right. Kane is just messing with his opponent now. Disqualify this man. Whoa, Jericho able to avoid damage. What a cagey maneuver. He's inflicting some serious pain here. Come on, Jericho, put that stupid idiot away. believe this one's still going on, especially after the beating that's been delivered tonight. These athletes seem to have tried everything in their playbook. Oh, there's more in their arsenal, I promise you that. I don't know what it is, but they'll find it. taken as we speak.
turn it on in a hurry. Oh, he's able to reverse it. The basement drop kick. Well executed drop kick. He's a spinning ball of energy. to put this away. Choke slam straight to hell. Just when you thought he had nothing left. Dug down deep and gets the shoulder up. Well, they call him a Lionheart for a reason, and there's the reason why. Kane's enjoying himself now. That strike hit the spot. There's no way he could have avoided that blow. Attack. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Chris Jericho. Ooh, Chris Jer Jeez. Wow. Incredible. This has to be it. Wow. Kane is getting absolutely pummeled. Chris Jericho is really applying pressure now. No question. He's feeling invincible right now. He can turn it on in a hurry. Here's Chris Jericho. Flying salt. That. And he goes for the pin. And Kane powers out. How'd he do that? Chris Jericho's middle name might as well be Showboat. Clearly on a mission here. Away. Hook slam straight to hell. That's a good way to find yourself on the list of Jericho. He goes for the cover. What? Oh, he kicked out. Unbelievable. Not even close. Here's Chris Oh, great. That was nasty. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Here we go for the win. Two, three. The pinfall and the victory. Let's take another look at what made that matchup so memorable. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. Wow. I haven't seen a match like that in a long time. I might go home and watch a replay. It was that good. Here is your winner, Chris Jericho. And that's a win to start off the night. And you just know the rest of the card is watching in the back, wondering how in the world they're going to follow that. What a way to kick off tonight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. Up next is the long-awaited championship match. It'll be Randy Orton against an imposing adversary. Nothing like a championship match. contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the United States 
Championship. Making his way to the ring from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, he is the apex predator, the Viper, Randy Orton. Randy Orton began his career by being known as the legend killer. Randy Orton is now simply a legend. Randy Orton's career wasn't built on alliances. The most important thing to Randy Orton has been winning championships. He has done that in a major way, a 13-time world champion. A 13-time world champion. As slick as they come. As smooth as anyone in the business. And as dangerous as anyone that walks the planet Earth. One half a team extreme. The charismatic enigma about to grace the WWE Universe with his presence. A true daredevil in every sense of the word, Jeff Hardy is immune to fear. Synonymous with tag team title reigns, a former United States champion, former world heavyweight champion. And what's amazing to think about, guys, is that the career of Jeff Hardy started at just the young age of 16. Singles action, you can expect Jeff Hardy to. Foil the WWE Universe. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Well, the two of you brought up Randy Orton and Jeff Hardy, and Randy is not jealous, you fools. The Viper realized that the fans will never truly embrace his amazing accolades, so he'll destroy other heroes as a result. Well, whether Orton will be successful in that mission remains to be seen, but I do think we've seen the reawakening of the Legend Killer. It doesn't get more blatant than that. I mean, I don't understand how the officials not seeing this. Close quarter. Oh, there's some good contact by Jeff Hardy. Oh, I think this man needs business. Looks like Randy Orton has broken a sweat. He has an amazing opportunity here to cement his legacy as one of the greatest champions in recent memory. Yeah, he's taking on some offense here, but that's to be expected, especially Ouch. considering who he's in the ring with. A 
lot of people are saying the champion has never looked better, but that doesn't mean we can't see an upset here tonight. He's inflicting some serious pain here. Randy Orton looking to finish this one early. He's a long way from a three count, I can tell you that. Not yet. Too early. As Byron was talking earlier about the champ being a heavy favor here tonight, I couldn't help but think back to the night Santino Morella defeated Umaga for the Intercontinental Championship in 2007. I don't think there was a person alive who thought Santino had even a sliver of hope. Yeah, including Santino himself. But hey, as the old saying goes, anything can happen in the oh, WWE. Man. Oh boy, he is rolling. Guys, these superstars really do appear to be in peak physical condition here tonight, which isn't surprising considering what's on the line here in this championship match. Look out, there he goes. Knocked right off his feet. Challenger starting to falter. Number one oh, contender or not, you'd hope he brought his A game here tonight. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Cole. This is just a little oh. slide. Is it enough, though? Yeah, talk about a bumpy landing. I gotta agree with you, Michael. These superstars are in tremendous... Pin broken up easily. Wow. Just go for the finisher already. I don't understand the delay. The object is to win the match, isn't it? Come on, let's go. His clothesline finds the mark. The champ starting to feel the pressure a bit. As Corey continues to criticize the action in the ring, allow me to take the other side of the argument. The last thing any superstar wants to do is go for the finisher prematurely. No good can come of that. Yeah, you really want to wait for the exact right time. If you go for it and miss, that could be the momentum shift your opponent has been waiting for. Jeff Hardy's not going to finish this. Bad spot for him to be in here, guys. He's got to do something to get back in this thing. Oh, I think this man means business. The Viper getting absolutely pounded right now. Orton looking for something big. Uh-oh. We may very well be seeing the finisher here very shortly, guys. And when that happens, you can bet this one's going to be over. And Jeff Hardy heads up the turnbuckle. This is the title match we've all been waiting for, guys. And so far, it's delivered the goods. I'm with Corey. I suspect the finisher is on the horizon. And given how impactful that move has been as of late, I'd say there's almost no coming back from it. You're right, Michael. It seems like that finisher has become more and more impactful with each passing week. But that's even possible. Back in from the floor. Clearly trying to take out the back here. Looks like he's pinpointing the back. Oh, no. Gets him in position. This is not going to end well for him, Michael. He's showing absolutely no pity now, guys. Both of these superstars appear to be operating on fumes here, guys. Oh, boy, he is rolling. He's inflicting some serious pain here. Can he score the pin? And the champ kicks out. And have to put in a little more work than that. Success breeds success, and he's definitely having some right now. Driven face first. Oh, what an up. 
uppercut. Orton looking for something big. Uh-oh. Randy Orton hits it. It's over. Just when you thought we were going to crowd him. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, and he's taken off his feet. I'll tell you, he can't afford to be horizontal at this point in the match, Cole. Randy Orton, no problem in getting out of that one. Back now inside the ring. Look at this. And here's Spear! The Viper that lands. The Viper strikes again. I thunderous power slam. The Viper strikes again. I love it. There may be no coming back from that slam, Cole. Good night. Just when you thought he had nothing left. Look at it in here. This could be it. And he's able to get out. I can't believe what we're seeing here. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to And Jeff Hardy brings everyone to their feet. Warm up the bus. This one is over. Jeff Hardy looking to attack from the ropes. Jeff Hardy's going for it. He has to possess a different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. the cover. One, two, three. Open the history books. We've got a new champion. That match deserves another look, folks. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. I can watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. Here is your winner and the new United States Champion, Jeff Hardy. And the first match of the night comes to an end in thrilling fashion. Yeah, the performance put forth in that match tells me we're looking at somebody who will someday, very soon, be competing in the main event. Plenty more action still to come here tonight, folks. Now, don't go anywhere. We have a classic coming up. We have one of our breakout talents versus The Miz. I can't wait. Underdogs in WWE history. A true Cinderella story after being told he could no longer compete inside of a WWE ring. Daniel Bryan fought long and fought hard and recaptured his dream and refuses to yes. let go. It was on the big stage of WrestleMania where Daniel Bryan realized his dream capturing the WWE Championship.
and his opponent, accompanied by Maurice, Curtis Axel, and Bo Dallas, residing in Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds, The Miz. Go ahead, Corey, tell us all about The Miz. The Miz is the man who single-handedly turned SmackDown from the B-Show to the show A star of stage, screen, reality television. Is there anything The Miz hasn't done? Did The Miz pay you to say all that, Corey? Absolutely not, Byron Saxton. I happen to be a hopeful for consideration for a Mizzy this year. Really? That's right. Oh, Mizzy? Oh, come on. That would be awesome, Corey. That would be ridiculous. Where would you put it? On my mantle with my most prized possessions. Why are you encouraging him, Michael? I would love to have a Miz. <laughs> There's a lot of pride on the line between these two athletes tonight. Two of the proudest athletes we have ever seen in WWE. Here we go, fellas. I've been looking forward to this one for quite some time. Line. Believe it or not, guys, this superstar wasn't overly pleased with this past week's rankings. You know what? I tend to agree. Who's voting on this stuff anyway? This kind of offense he's known for. The big boot is falling. He's starting to stumble here. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. Well, while I disagree with Corey's assessment of this week's rankings, I do support his right to an opinion. And you too can voice your opinion on this week's rankings by using hashtag WWE Power Rankings on social media. And I'm seeing a lot of varying opinions, which is great. Though, interestingly enough, I don't see any that agree with what Corey was saying. Go figure. to the voters this past week. It seems they finally got the rankings right. And I know this superstar agrees with me. It's about time. He misses the dive. And unfortunately for him, there was no water in the pool. Well, while Corey lauds the power rankings voting process, I will say that there are more than a few people who think a few mistakes were made this past week, particularly as it relates to the superstars ranking. Michael, I'm not at all surprised to hear that Corey has a different opinion than pretty much the rest of the world. It's like he's not happy unless he's pushing somebody's buttons. Guys, I was in the locker room when the latest rankings were released, and I can tell you that a lot of people were shaking their heads over this superstar's ranking. Oh, no! He's looking a little weary here. 
I'm not, I don't know why anybody would be shaking their head over the superstar's ranking, Corey. It's been one impressive performance after another. If you ask me, oh, it's well-deserved. I completely agree, Michael, and I wouldn't put too much stock in what Corey was saying anyway. He tends to hang with a pretty cynical crowd these days. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Cutting it close here, guys. What a coward. He's trying to get himself counted out, Cole. Look out! Oh, talk about getting flattened. Yeah, she's going to be feeling that one for a while. <laughs> look out, look out. This could be it. He comes up big there. Here's his chance. I couldn't be more impressed by that combination, Michael. I don't think he could do it here. And Miz kicks out. Gonna take more than that. What does the Miz have to do at this point to stay in this match? I'd say he's starting to feel the pressure a bit. If he wants to win this thing, he's gonna need to make some changes here. There's no way he can stay in this match if he doesn't find a way to fend off this attack. He's taking on some damage, but so is his opponent. This match can go either way at this point. Seems to me, guys, like we're just moments away from seeing the finisher, which could obviously put this match on ice. Nice job by the Miz. That slam put him in a bad way, guys. The Miz is showboating, but I'm not sure this occasion calls for it. Got him good with the punch. Knocked him right off his feet. Yeah, no kidding. His drop kick connects. The Miz was just one step behind there, guys. Not where he wants to be right now. Hey, he got himself into this mess. He's got to get himself out of it now. The Miz, that's going to be it. Oh. I'm not sure how much he has left. There he is. I really can't believe what's gone down so far. This match is the crushing finale. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Here's a cover. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. Nice job getting out of the way of that one. What we've seen and heard tonight, there must be serious injuries. Uh-oh. Here we go. Here we go. No question, perfectly timed slam. Victory is on the horizon. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Going for it all here. <laughs> That'll rock him. This is his opportunity to win this thing. The Miz's chances just went from bad. Can he score the pin? What is keeping this competitor going? I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. The Miz was able to get out of the way there. 
Oh, I think this man needs business. Uh-oh, the big boot has fallen. This has been a battle. Oh, go for it! Go for it! The yes lock is applied. Will his opponent tap? This one's over, guys. Wow, he escapes it. He's just got no quit in him here tonight, Cole. He somehow breaks free. Nice, but he clearly has next to nothing left to give here. He's focusing on the face now. There's a pin now. What? Oh, he kicked out. Unbelievable. Just powered out. I think things are about to get turned upside down. I think you... And the cover for the win. This is it. Two. And he's able to get out. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Ooh, he goes down hard. Yeah, he's definitely starting to fade now. There's no recovering from that. Oh, he's such a tough target. He delivers a hard clothesline. Look out, there he goes. Knocked right off his feet. Oh boy, he is rolling. Going all the way up. Incoming. your heartbeat. Oh boy, he is rolling. Bonnie dodges out of the way. Look at this. Miz. And the Miz delivers the snap DDT and that should do it. Game, set, match. This one is over. guys eludes that one he's in clip he's cover here one two three what a way to win a singles match that's yeah, a big big win man what a hard fought victory for him tonight I'm not sure if he was going to pull it out, but he did. Wait a minute. What's going through his mind? Well, it's been a very personal rivalry for many, many months now. And, oh, and I, not this personal. Not the steel oh. chair. Oh, my God. Stop him. Get in there, rep, and stop him.
Up next is the long-awaited championship match. We have a real fan favorite against AJ Styles. This one's going to be a classic. contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Championship. Look who's here, the animal Batista. Look who's here, the animal Batista. I cannot believe the WWE Universe's reaction to Batista. This guy takes time out of his busy movie star schedule to return to WWE, and they've given him nothing but disrespect. You have to respect the animal. The phenomenal AJ Styles. When you talk about AJ Styles, the list of accomplishments is seemingly endless. Styles, a true global superstar before arriving in WWE. But since he's been here, AJ Styles has lived up to the moniker, phenomenal. Yeah, it's crazy to think that when AJ Styles made his debut at the Royal Rumble a couple years ago, he wondered if he would even fit in the WWE. But obviously he has done more than just fit in. He has excelled at this level. One of the toughest individuals I have ever seen compete in a WWE ring. Introducing the challenger from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, the animal, Batista! Introducing the champion from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, he is the WWE Champion, the Phenomenal, AJ Styles! Get ready for some WWE magic.
Taming the Wild Beast is a cakewalk in comparison to taming the animal Batista. I think there's a good chance we'll be seeing a painful Batista bomb tonight. Painful would be putting it lightly. Devastating is more accurate. Oh, man. The challenge is starting to slow down a bit here. He's going to have to find a way to fend off the champ here. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment tonight. You don't step in the ring with this guy and walk away completely unscathed. This match is so evenly contested right now that it's almost impossible to pick a winner. I guess we'll just have to settle in and enjoy the action. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. You see a great opportunity here for the challenger who can't afford to make any mistakes here tonight. Not when you're in the ring with a champion as dominant as this one. This is going to be bad for Batista. The animal is not in the best of shape here, King. He needs to use that power to get back in this match. To follow up Byron's earlier point, the challenger has to remember just how rare championship opportunities truly are. AJ Styles into the cover. And there's a kick out at one. Not yet. AJ Styles caught a bit off guard there. Which is a rare sight. Oh, at this point, it's all about Batista might get an early three count. He's oh, getting man. after it while he has the energy. Smart move. Normally, we hear plenty of debates surrounding the weekly power rankings, but this week, it seems both fans and superstars alike agree with how everything shook out. Oh, I think this man needs business. Too much debate over the rankings this week, though. I will say that some people from the Superstars camp think it could have been just a little more favorable. You can't please everybody, oh. Saxton. These are the same people who would win the lottery and then complain about having a, a spear. Incredible! I think this is the beginning of a resounding move by Batista. And the champ kicks out. Yeah, it's going to take more than that to keep him down. You gotta think about using the finisher here pretty soon, I would think. Just pick up the AJ Styles may have it. Styles clash! But he's gotta capitalize now. Uh, yeah, there's no way. There's the pinfall. And the victory. Now's a good time to look at some of the highlights from that last matchup. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. There's good, there's great, and then there's downright unbelievable WWE action. Ladies and gentlemen, you just got a taste of the unbelievable kind. Kicking off the night with an impressive victory. And you just know the rest of the card is...